Hello and welcome back to another Minecraft build and today we are going to be building a medieval house so this is the materials that you will need oak wood, cobblestone, wool, spruce wood, stairs, spruce wood slabs, glass pane, oak wood planks and an oak door so the first thing you want to do is get your oak wood place your first block down Skip three, place another one down. Skip another three, place another one down. Skip three, place three. And then there you go, you get this. And then we'll basically just do it like so until we get to here. Yeah, actually, we'll deal with this part first. So, you've got your front three. With the two three gaps in the middle, so you put a two here, just a two gap, and then a three gap, and then another three gap, and like so. Then you just do another two, and then you do the three, the three, the two, and the two. So you would have something like so. So now. You just want to build them up for two more and they are let's get all these and okay there we go now we've got all of our uh, structure in place so now you want to get your cobblestone you want to build around here this is where your door is going to go next one over you want to build all around this except for leave one in the middle and then put a glass pane in there these this one will be filled in as as this one so both of them will be fully filled in then uh i'll leave this part out at the minute so you want to do the same as the front with the window on both of these back ones this time though so you want to do that and then you fill this one completely up to the top same with this one now here you want to fill this side up you just want to fill all this up here like so there we go actually you delete the top row of this so you will end up like this so now we will go over here and actually we will need another <coughs> another block which is the never rack and then you want to put some cobble up around like so and then you will just fill in the back like so so you'll have that there so it just sticks out a bit then you'll have this in here so now we will build up a bit more with the wood build it up three more There we go. Now we want to get our actually yeah we'll put this back here. So we want to build that up to there and we'll get some spruce stairs and then we'll make this into a peaked roof. Okay, once you get to the top, you just place a few slabs down, but over here you will place an upside down stair and start facing out that way. So you will get th this roof effect. And if you just want to come around here, you can put the stairs upside down just so it looks a bit smoother. Right, okay. Now we want to 
build this up a bit up to here so just two more really mm -hmm. just two more on each side may even have to delete a few blocks and it's raining let's just turn off the rain so the rain's annoying okay now we've got this so now we are going to put on the next roof let's just delete this part here so now we just want to go like so the whole way across So we've got six. So basically want to follow this pattern with the wood now. Delete this row as well. And you just build up like so. And there we go. So that's that side and a few more blocks on this side Let's... there we go okay so we've got this and now we want to just fill in the roof like so Now, once you come up to the top of the roof, it's basically the same as the other roof. You just put the slabs in to each of the cobblestone, the upside down stair, and the stair facing out. And you do it, you don't do it this side because you build up the cobblestone four high and then build up the rest. So it's going to be a chimney. And let's get an iron bar. An iron bar is going to be the top of the chimney. Oh, oh I deleted the door. I still need the door. There we go. All we need to do is put the upside down stairs now in. Onto both sides. And on the other side. There we go. So you will have this look now. But the roof looks a bit too big. It looks a bit too bare as well. So you come in three on each side. So you'll get a five gap in the middle. You will get the um your logs that you've had. Actually, let's build it out. Build it one back, like so. Build it up three. Then we will get the wool. And then we will just build this up, like so. Not with such a use cobble. Because the world doesn't look good on this texture pack. So we'll get the cobble built up like so. And also one back on each of them sides. Just so you don't see through the thing. Now we need to get our oak wood. Our oak wood is going to be our floor. So we'll just do the front for now. Then we place two doors down. Actually, let's just do that. Place the doors down. We actually change these two upside down stairs. Like so. Then we need to get an 
end augment and we just go around like this and it's a wee balcony for us and then we just place slabs along the top of this here so there is the finished roof now we can come inside now and we can just break all of this dirt except for the free blocks in front of the fireplace there don't want to break them yet we just basically fill in the entire floor like so we also want a window in here in the back There we are, we've got our floor in. Let's actually put the, the roof floor in as well. I also need to put some cobblestone in there. Let's just put cobblestone up there. Or we can put oak wood up, the spruce wood up here. Like so. And place stairs down. Like so. There we go. There we go there. Actually, I don't like that. Just put them down. Like, there we go. Now we need to finish off these. This floor. Like so, there we go, there's the floor finish, let's just continue this on, and then we can put a stair there, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Or we can actually put uh, oak, oak stairs in here, we don't need the glass panes anymore, we can put oak in here, instead of uh, spruce just to the match it with the other floor and then we can just put two oak blocks in there there we go so there we go we've got each floor in so now we can put our door in like so now if we go inside we need to get some stone slabs we'll go stone slabs so we can get rid of the door and the fences and also the wall So now the stone slabs completely free. Put them in, and it's like the wee mantelpiece, and then you can put these on top as well. So let's get actually a stair, cobblestone stair. Place it like that, and we can also have iron bars with our flint and steel. So basically like that and then you put the iron bars around there and you've got a nice wee fireplace so there we go um, we are going to get upstairs now so just break these and then get a ladder and you can get up here now so we can get everywhere in the house we can get out here and all so now is left to do is to furnish the place so now in here we're going to have some let's see we're going to have some let's get some birchwood stairs and then we can oh yeah i forgot to put the glass in back here Oops. So we can get some stairs, and if we go over here, we can make we can make ourselves a table. Like so. We 
go away table. We can also make this double wide. We can go away family home. There we go, we've got a table there. We can get item frames and stick them on the arms so it just looks like we armrests. Now for over here we're going to get some more of the birch stairs and the, the item frames and we are going to have sort of a seating area in here so we can have a two wide seat and just a one wide so there we go then we can get the uh, Fence and the pressure plate again for the table. It's going to be in the room. We can place the table right here. It's going to be right beside the fireplace. We can even place a bit of carpet down. A few bits of carpet in there. Like so. So over here we're going to have a chest basically on either side with a crafting table in the middle so we can use this for survival as well like you'll have most things for survival in here as well so you can go in here place some furnaces down as well so we can place some furnaces down here we can have some chests about the place we can have a chest here with another crafting table and a chest up here with some trap doors. Trap doors can act like shelf to put them on. So we've got our kitchen, we've got our living area, we've got our dining area and we've got a storage place. Now we go up the stairs and we can get our bed our bed will just go right in the center we can also have some storage space up here we can put a chest in here and a chest in here and on the other side we can also get oak wood just to sort of separate the chests out so you can still open these because of the stairs above now we can Get some torches because it's a bit dark in here so we can just place the torches up here and up here we go we can get some stairs there we go now we we can also have some where is it we can also have some bookshelves in here. Have some bookshelves around the bed to another side. And we can actually just one on the other side. And we're gonna have like some carpet on the bookshelves. To make it look a bit nicer. We can also have some carpet in here. With a few more chests. Or even we could have Brain stand up here with a stair. Jeez, oak stair. She's a birch stair. Do that. Place that on it. And also place some more bookcases down. And let's just put that in the center. Get them off. And there we go. So actually get some more torches for downstairs and outside place some torches outside here down here place some torches about place we don't need any torches over here because of the fireplace so light it up now we've got a completed house completed medieval house so we'll just circle around like so. Got our chimney here, we've got the back of the house, got the extension, we've got the front. So 
I hope you enjoyed this build. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you all next time. Bye!